What up, everybody? I'm Jeannie. Welcome back to Magenta Tarot Messages. We'll be tapping into your energy, Virgo. See what you can be looking forward to. I've already shuffled for this, and you already know what it is. So let's just begin. What is the energy Virgo could be looking forward to? We have peace and trust, okay? So that is beautiful energy to start out with, Virgo. Success at the bottom of the map. Uh, the map. Okay, something may be uh, um, a trail to get to, a hike. It may be several steps to get to a place, Virgo. But you will succeed here. What be looking forward to is peace, being at peace with yourself, your surroundings, and you're having a peace of mind, I heard. You're going to be able to trust something. I accept my inner voice will always guide me correctly. I feel like there's something that's going to lead you towards peace, Virgo, and you're going to be able to trust your environment, trust yourself, and know that you are going to succeed here. One more card. What is the energy Virgo can be looking forward to? Love. Wow. Peace, trust, and love. That sounds like a relationship that I want, okay? <laughs> that sounds like something uh, off of my list right here with the peace, love, and trust. Virgo, you may be stepping into a new partnership, but there may be something coming in for you that you're going to be able to feel peaceful in, all right? Find love in and really trust this person or opportunity. What's coming in for Virgo that they can look forward to? We have discord between friends and family. And then we have July. Okay, so Virgo, you may be in a time where there's a lot of discord with your friends and family up until the month of July or until a cancer comes in. Virgo, look forward to. Then we have dealing with a relationship with a woman with dark complexion or hair. And then we have someone will gossip about your secrets. Okay. So Virgo, what you can look forward to is um, <laughs> discord amongst friends and family. This may be discord uh, outside of yourself. As in you have nothing to do with it. That's why you can look forward to it, Virgo. Um, I don't know why you would look forward to discord. Other than it, it bringing about a change. Um, with the July energy, this could be happening up to the month of July. Something could be happening in the month of July. After the month of July, I feel like something is going to come in for you, Virgo. Um, a woman may be telling all your secrets, okay? Um, or somebody you have discord with, a family member, um, some type of energy here, maybe telling secrets or talking about you. Okay, the only way I can see this as a positive is be is because you get to figure out like who is like a real friend, who is real family here, and who's the gossipers, who's the problem. Um, so yeah, figuring out who you can have peace around, who you can trust, who you can love, Virgo. What is this energy Virgo could be looking forward to? What is the overall energy of what Virgo could be looking forward to? Ten of Cups. Wow. Okay. Um, Ten of Cups energy talks about a happy home life, happy family life, wish fulfillment, dreams coming true, long-term commitments here. Maybe the Six of Pentacles. What is the overall energy of what Virgo could be looking forward to? We have the Seven of Swords, the Devil, the Six of Pentacles, and the Three of Wands. I feel like with the Seven of Swords, there was definitely something that wasn't truthful here. Okay, there's some type of deception going on around toxic energy or toxic things that you were receiving that you were giving into virgo three of wands that you may have to turn your back on okay so it's giving that to have this ten of cups energy you may need to turn your back on um discord toxic family members toxic friendships here that you were giving into or uh allowing in your energy allowing to be in your way what are these people what was this energy causing virgo we have the ten of pentacles the death card and the page of pentacles this energy was 
transforming something very prosperous, Virgo, into something that uh, wasn't very fruitful. Okay, it goes from the Ten of Pentacles to the Death card to the Page of Pentacles. This is a transformation, um, nine pentacles down here, Virgo. So to go from the Ten to the Page of Pentacles, there was a loss here. I feel like you may have lost your independence. You may have lost something that was keeping you self-sufficient here. Um, there could have been some type of decrease in some type of way in your energy due to toxic people, um, due to discord, due to uh, people in your energy here, Virgo. Go. we have the nine of wands and the two of cups here the nine of cups this could have been lovers okay family members distracting you virgo how does virgo get this ten of cups energy how does virgo get this ten of cups energy the six of cups somebody returning here the hang dragon the seven of cups here learn from past mistakes here virgo there's past people in your life presently still in your life here that you need to release sacrifice they need to go somewhere virgo with the six of cups the seven of cups and the hang dragon this is really seeing that you need to release the past here virgo past people past friends past family members past family dynamics that previously worked for you this is the energy of something you were receiving um, while you were waiting or in a wait period or while you were trying to expand Virgo may have inadvertently made you step backwards. You may have stepped backwards trying to preserve something here. And it's really now time to see the illusion and sacrifice past people in order to come into this peace, trust, love, energy that God has set up for you. Tell me about this peace, love, and trust. What should Virgo know about this peace, love, and trust energy? What should Virgo know about this peace, love, and trust energy? The five of pentacles. It comes with leaving something or someone out in the cold. It comes with grief. It comes with a loss. It comes with a breakup here, Virgo. leaving something out star card it's the healing of a lack energy too peace love and trust virgo you're dealing with something hierophant you're dealing with something people institutions family friends energy here that is toxic low vibrational keeping you trapped um literally lowering your standard of life here and spirit is trying to get you to manifest out of this it's the it's the uh, simple fact of uh, seeing the illusions around you and releasing them okay so you may feel like this is a situation you're stuck in until you can get somewhere better you may feel like this is something you have to deal with until something else happens here virgo but in the meantime between time spirit is saying this is the time to see the illusions um get it about get it out of your energy here and start manifesting and trusting and knowing that the universe will heal this for you. Okay, so I feel like Virgo, this was a lesson here. If you had some type of decrease, if there was some type of um, loss of stability, if there was some type of loss of independence, you may have went backwards on your spiritual trail. You may have um, big backslidden, I heard. Okay, um, this is the energy of realizing, oh, I backslidden. I can't exactly get to where I want momentarily or at, at this moment so i'm going to take the steps to get there okay even if that means letting go of people even that if that means not talking to those friends and family anymore even if it means people are going to be gossiping about me hermit card i feel like virgo you're gonna find this peace love and trust and isolation when you're by yourself here eight of swords and the three of swords you may have been dealing with somebody who was an energetic trap, okay? This person brought down your um, vibration, your finances, your energy, your life here. There's someone who could have been doing this for multiple people in your energy or an institution or a job here, Virgo. But you're going to find your answers in solitude. You're going to find this peace, love, and trust on your own. You're going to heal your finances and get back to the where you're supposed to be on your spiritual path, your physical path, your um, real path here. 
and really start to heal and renew. So spirit is about to bring back everything that you lost, but you had to lose it in order to see um, the people, places, and things around you. That's what I got here for you, Virgo. If you resonated with anything here, please give me a like, comment down below. Subscribe to the channel to see what's coming up next for the Virgos. And get ready for this increase and get ready to let things go. That's what I got here for you. Peace.